it's Tracy. So today our workout, we are gonna hit it. So this is a high intensity interval training workout. So we're gonna do 50 seconds on with a 10 second rest and it's gonna be eight cycles through, okay? So this is the exact workout that I did at the gym the other day. And I have to tell you, I was sore in some really good places around my butt right underneath there. So I thought I would share it with you. So I am using my gym boss timer here. It's my new bestie. I absolutely love this. So if you don't have one, make sure to get one in the links below and enjoy this hit workout. Hit it. Okay, so let's get started with high knees up. So 50 seconds. Get those knees up. Draw in your belly. Really drive those knees up. Good. Keep on breathing. That's it. Belly's pulling nice and tight here. Good. You can do it. Make sure you're breathing. Feeling it? Don't get lazy. Lift those knees. Lift those knees. Keep going. Whew. You can do it. Awesome. 10 second rest. Whew. So try not to totally stop. Just keep your breath here. We're gonna go next into a side lunge with a crunch. So hands on your head, reach towards the outside of one foot, then elbow down, crunch. Reach down and crunch, that's it. Really get into that side lunge, really nice big reach here, okay? Down, you'll feel that stretch in your inner thigh here as you're reaching down. Keep your belly pulled in. That's it. Reach out. Good. Pull in. That's it, a few more. Good, so 10 second rest here. Good, feeling good? I hope so. Next we're gonna go into jumping jacks, okay? So 50 seconds of jacks. And here we go. Jack it out. You can change your arms here if you wanted to just do like half jack arms here. It's totally up to you. Just do whatever feels best. Good, really do it with intention and energy. So you want these intervals to be blasts. So you're really, really feeling it. Good, keep going. I love these intervals because everything just goes by so much faster. It's more fun. That's it, you can do it. Good, 10 second rest. Keep the breath going. Good. And here we go, so side lunge on the other side. So reach out, crunch over, reach out, and crunch, that's it. Reach, crunch, you got it. And reach, keep going, your belly is drawn in tight. Reach, good, a few more. That's it. Good, so that other leg is straight leg. Really keep it straight. Good. Belly is tight here. Big deep lunge. A few more. Excellent, good. 10 second rest here. So on the strength ones, obviously, you're not gonna be quite so out of breath, but it's still good. Keep walking, keep moving here, okay? Good, and here we go to jump rope. So, you know, with jump rope, you have freedom here. I always like to do two and two out. Just feels good. But you still wanna really keep that intention, keep the energy up. Good. That's it. Keep on going. Good, that's it. So it's in, in, out, out. And really visualize like you're jumping rope.
excellent. Good. on this one, that would be completely fine. Totally, totally fine here. I'm not just today because just not, but you could definitely do this with up to three, three or five pound weights being maximum. Okay, I tend to really stick to two pound weights. Really get your rump going out on turn sideways so that the butt is really going far behind you, okay? Important here because that's what gets you feeling it right underneath your butt so that your butt stays lifted. Good. Excellent. Abs are tight. Good. Big level change here. Awesome. Good. So 10 second rest here. And then we're going to go into a twist. Love the twist. It's one of my favorites. You ready? Here we go. So one, two, double punch. One punch, double punch. Single, single, double. Single, single, double. These ones are fun because it feels like dancing. Single, single, double punch. Good, you got it. Have fun with this. Really move your butt. The more you move, the more you're gonna tone along the sides of your body here. So that's what we want, right? Good. Keep on going. Awesome. Keep it light on your feet so you don't hurt your knees here, your ankles. Good, 10 second rest. Whew. And then we're gonna go into some alternating lunges with a bicep curl. Again, you could do this with weights if you wanted to. So you're gonna step back, bicep curl. Step back, good. Step back, curl, step back. So the arms just keep going, down and up. Step back, that's it. So really drive that knee in using your abdominals here. Good. Alternating legs in between. Keep going here. Good, really drive that knee in. So we're trying to make this as full body and efficient as humanly possible. So really get that knee up. Don't get lazy and just give me like a, yeah, lift my knee. That's not gonna work. That's not gonna give you the changes that I know you are looking for. Good. Excellent. And good, so 10 second rest here again. You did awesome. So I want you to go through those eight moves three to four times. And when you have, as always, make sure to leave me a comment below and let me know that you did the workout. Also, if you haven't already, be sure to join me over at tracycampoli.com. That's where I share all kinds of recipes, tips, lifestyle ideas, everything just for you. So make sure that you join us over there. Okay, hope you enjoyed the workout and you felt the hit, hit, hit.